How gorgeous this is. The newest Apple store in uh, downtown LA is now open, but it's so much more than just a place to buy an iPhone. It's at the historic Apple Tower Theater, a place, as NBC4's Kim Baldonado explains, that has been debuting new technology since the 1920s. It's no surprise many customers walked into the newest Apple store with cell phone cameras pointed to the ceiling. Well, it's great to see a building like this. It's amazing. By looking up, you get a sense of the history and grandeur of this building, from the original 1920 chandelier to the ornate trim and ceiling murals, which have been meticulously restored. It's gorgeous. It's a great, great place to have an Apple store. The downtown Los Angeles store is inside the Tower Theater, built in 1927 along LA's historic theater row on the corner of Broadway and 8th Street. We live in the neighborhood. Um, we've been downtown residents for 13 years, and we toured this. Um, before it was rehabbed. Major rehab was needed since the Tower Theater sat vacant for the past three decades. But when it first opened, it made history as the first theater in L.A. to be wired for sound, the first to have air conditioning, and the first theater in the world to show a talkie. In place of the 1920s movie screen is a video wall where daily tutorials called Apple Sessions will take place. You can watch from the mezzanine, which has been transformed into a waiting area for the Genius Bar, which is housed in the balcony. I'm just delighted because we need good stewards again for the, for the theaters. While modern products line the walls, original marble drinking fountains remain in place, as well as the grand marble staircase in the lobby, complete with original brass railings and that chandelier, sparkly now that decades of cigarette smoke have been removed. Apple CEO Tim Cook was on hand for the opening. While he chose not to speak to us, he gladly posed for selfies with employees, while many customers prefer to use their iPhone to capture the 1920s architecture in all its restored glory. In downtown LA, Kim Baldonado, NBC4 News.